I'm Anil Kumar and we'll explore area model to find product of mixed numbers. The question here is calculate product of mixed numbers using area model. We need to multiply 2 1 over 3 by 1 1 over 4. Let us see how to do it. So what we will do here is we'll make a rectangle and we'll divide it into parts to represent the mixed number. So when we say 2 1 over 3 let us say this is this is 1 this is 2 and that is 1 third right. So let me say this is 1 third so I'm writing drawing a line here representing one side of this rectangle as 2 plus 1 over 3. So that is 2 1 over 3 okay. Now 1 1 over 4 we can represent the width of the rectangle as 1 1 over 4. So for that let me actually draw another line here dividing the width into two parts where we are saying this is one whole and this one is one fourth. So the width here is 1, 1 out of 4 and the length in this case is 2, 1 over 3, correct? So that is how we have divided our rectangle. Now once we do it, we actually have four rectangles within a big rectangle. So you know, area of the whole is some of these four areas, right? So area, which is product of these two, length times width, is some of these four areas. Let us find that sum. So this one here is one times two. Let me write this as one times two. What we get is two, right? So this is two. So area of this rectangle is two. Let me write two here plus area of that rectangle, which is one times 1 over 3. That is to say it is 1 over 3. Correct? So we'll add this one to 2. What is the area of this rectangle? 1 fourth of 2. So it is 1 4 times 2 or it could be written as half. Correct? So that is the area for this portion. So we'll add half to it. How about this one? This is 1 fourth times 1 third, right? So when you multiply 3 times 4 is 12, that comes in the denominator, 1 times 1, 1 in the numerator. So we'll add that also. Adding the area of these four rectangles will give us area of the whole rectangle. So we get 2 plus these fractions. Now to add these fractions, we should have common denominator, right? What could be the common denominator? It is 12. To make 12, I have to multiply 3 by 4, so we get 4 over 12. To make 12, 2, I have to multiply by 6, 6 over 12, this is already 12, right? So let's add them, 2 plus 4 plus 6, 10, 10 plus 1, 11, so we get 2, 11 over 12. And therefore, we get our answer, which is 2 whole, 11 out of 12. So that is how you can actually multiply. Now let us check the same using alternate method. Alternate method which you have learned is to write these mixed numbers as improper fractions and then multiply numerators and denominators. So 2, 3 over 6, 2 times 3 is 6, 6 plus 1, 7. So we get 7 over 3 times 1 times 4, 4, 4 plus 1, 5, 5 over 4. Now you multiply numerators, which is 35, denominators, which is 12. So we get 35 divided by 12. To write it in this form, we have to convert them back into mixed numbers, which we do by long division. You divide 35 by 12. 12 times 2 is 24, and the remainder is 11. That is to say, it could be written as 2, 11 over 12. So it works, right? However, we have to use the area model and I hope you got the concept of area model, which is visual representation of 
multiplication of fractions. I hope this concept is clear to you. Thank you and all the best.